Hello and welcome back. So in this video, I'll show you how to use a list view to display a list of items. List of items is a pretty useful functionality and most of the time you'll be dealing with, you know, such kind of functionalities where you've got to display a list of restaurants, a list of food items, list of movies and whatnot. And it's pretty simple to implement. So the way we do it in Android is to use a list view element this is the um, this this view item that is the list view allows us to display the list either vertically or horizontally and this list can come from a array it can come from a class file it can come from a database from a web service so we'll explore more as we go along but for now what I've done is I've just created a string array in the strings resource xml file now this resource xml file i don't know if i've talked about it and if you're familiar with it but it's it's useful for internationalization like if you want your app to display the um, the labels the content in different languages based on the user preference then you just have to define all your text in one xml file like this one and Android will automatically pick the appropriate one at runtime. Okay, so okay, coming back to the list view. So we have defined a list of array items which I've called mobiles, and the item names I've given like Samsung, Nexus, Motorola, and this will render in the as part of the list view. So, so when you define a list view in your layout XML file, then width and height you already know these are like mandatory you have to define them and then the important part is the entries so the entries attribute refers to you know the array the string array that we created so we use at the rate array and we provide the name of the string array that we created and that's it like it's as simple as that uh, so currently it's in the design view it's not running in an emulator so you, you won't be able to see this display but yeah when you run this app in an emulator so you will see these three items show up that is the samsung galaxy nexus and motorola so go ahead try this out i'll share the github link for this file so that you can view it and uh, in the next video we'll look at the listeners and adapters which come in handy with the list view. So until next time, see you. Bye.